Hello, 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 everyone. Happy Halloween. The best holiday of the year, as far as I'm concerned. Um, yeah, and today we're going to be streaming Resident Evil. Now, this isn't the original Resident Evil, from what I understand. Oh, by the way, this is Paul. Oh, yeah, I was going to say, by the way, this is Sung, and this is Paul. Howdy. I am Paul. Uh, <laughs> Happy Halloween. Yeah, today we're checking, taking a look at Resident Evil. So this is the uh, the remaster that was that came out on PS4 a few years back. And I was telling you before we right before we started streaming that this is the remaster of a remaster. It's like the like it's like Diddy was like the creative director of this one. He like remixed huh. the remix. So like, um, yeah. So this was like the GameCube version, and then they like kind of they just upresed everything and added some nice 3D models and stuff. Uh, -huh. uh what's up, Zero? What's up, Dice Game? And uh, they they have this like really cool feature um, where it just kind of pan and scans the screen because it was originally uh -huh. made four by three like a square to fit your TV at the time. Right. So how did they do that? Uh, they just like you basically just zoom into the to the the picture and then you manually zoom in depend uh, depending on where the character is kind of walking on the screen, which is kind of cool. Right. But um, but yeah, but other than that, this is pretty much Resident Evil, the OG. And and mm. it, we I stumbled. No, nah, I was just joking about Diddy being the creative director. <laughs> I didn't know about that. <laughs> that would be kind of cool though if Diddy worked at Capcom and we didn't even know about it the whole time. But uh, oh, thank you, Thanks. Amanda. Appreciate it. Um, so what's dope is that uh, I stumbled upon a wonderful. Uh, opportunity today mm -hmm. and Sung has never played well I mean you know about Resident Evil you know about the series you know about you know what kind of impact Definitely. it's had uh, but you've never played it all the way through yeah so there's a bit of a backstory to that actually okay, um, okay let's hear it so not only and Paul and I had this had this whole conversation earlier but not only have I never played Resident Evil but basically if it's a horror video game that isn't amnesia I haven't played it so that means I haven't played Resident <laughs> Evil I haven't played uh, uh, Alien Isolation I never played PT. <laughs> I gotta. I'm gonna bring my PS. I have have it on both of my PS4s at home. Uh -huh. My base and my pro. Yeah, you gotta bring that in. I'm gonna bring it in. We're gonna be, yeah, I should have done it today. I didn't. I was. Uh. I was. So full disclosure. I wasn't supposed to dream today, but I stepped in to to handle it. But having stumbled upon this wonderful secret, we can now plan for that in the future. And I hope you don't. No one spoil PT for him, please. But also, <laughs> uh, I mean, it's not not that much to spoil. I mean, you, it's, it's, it's Silent Hills. Right? Oh my God, it's spoiler. Like a demo. Yeah, it's a demo. It was yeah. like it was like a really difficult demo. But I'm the same way. I'm like I'm kind of hit or miss with the with the scary games. I I like to lead a peaceful, happy life, full of love, happiness. Mm -hmm. uh, <laughs> but every <laughs> once in a while, I'll jump into like a spooky game. But Amnesia is like wild scary. I'm I'm surprised you went from like zero to a hundred well, on the scary game side. I think because back when Amnesia first came out, like it it became kind of like a meme, right? Everyone was streaming it. Everyone was talking about yeah, it. it was extended popular. beyond like the video game community into the general population. Yeah. So I kind of felt like I had to play it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I mean, full disclosure, I didn't make it to the end. I know, me neither. <laughs> <laughs> I played that with like with friends in the room. There was no other way I could play it. But uh -huh. um, without further ado, let's just jump right into yeah. Resident All Evil. Right. I'm so curious. Resident Evil, press any button. Will do. I might even turn the volume up for this for this stream in particular. Oh, does the volume help with the scariness? Absolutely. Oof. Yeah, go for it. Data. Go for it. We're starting from scratch, so you guys are witnessing history. Oof. Join us. <laughs> if it's too low, I'm gonna I'm gonna hop over there and turn up the audio real quick. Alrighty. Yeah, new game. New game. New game. Yeah. Resident Oh yeah, so uh, Dead Space I have played a little bit. So it's not like, so I think my um, kind of what's what's the word? Like I don't want to say revulsion because it's, it's not revulsion. Kind of like a off turning, sure, 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 off putting kind of thing. Yeah, like, yeah. It only stretches to like games that are like absolutely like horror at its forefront. Like I love Bioshock, which has this really kind of like that's got some spooky elements yeah, to it. Like a spooky atmosphere, like atmospheric core. Those those games I'm perfectly fine with. But games okay. with like I don't know, like jump scares and things like that. I just Yeah just yeah not my cup of tea, I don't think. Uh hold on real quick. Yeah. So uh um Amanda said the sound of aliens stomping around this <laughs> Alien stomping around was the same as my flatmates in my student quarter. That's <laughs> hilarious. But um, so yeah, so the cool thing about this is you can play in widescreen, which is what I was talking about, like the pan and scan, the pan and scan thing, mm -hmm. or you can switch to original and you just have it all like in a in a box, um, you know, with right. bars on the side. Let's go wide for this one. Okay, sounds good. Um, controls. This is interesting. So you can use the new control scheme, or you can use the original. 
I'm curious to know what, like how chat feels about original tank controls. I don't know if you ever heard that term tank controls. I have not. So like that's kind of where like the I mean Resident Evil series back in the day was kind of like notorious for its tank controls. So left mm -hmm. was always left, right was always right depending on where your character was on screen. Right. Um so you know and and up was always forward and down was always back. Huh. I would say let's do original tank controls. Okay. Cuz in my opinion part of the like part of the fear of this game is like not being able to just like <laughs> move <laughs> like like trying to get the hell up out of the corner or whatever uh -huh. so uh yeah and some people got used to the tank controls yeah exactly these people agree let's go to tank controls all right let's do it and we'll keep subtitles on in case sure. uh people can't hear or whatever so yeah i mean i naturally keep the subtitles on okay. for everything dope dope so that works for me let's do it right. okay oh That's yeah nice. i'm curious to see if they have quick turnaround if you could do like down in circle or down in x mm -hmm. um how do you like your games like a climb like climbing a mountain fulfilling but takes a lot of work mm -hmm. Like going on a hike, good exercise, but not too strenuous. Or like taking a walk, you can relax and enjoy yourself. Hmm. I like how they like, f you know, phrase this. Yeah. It's how, they, how they present this. Vaguely poetic. <laughs> uh, yeah, let's go with normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, it's like going on a hike. Yeah. Not too strenuous. I mean, I wouldn't know. Like, I haven't been on a hike in years. <laughs> oh, okay. So now we can choose uh, which character you want to play as, which I think was like a, a new feature for this remaster. So you can play as Chris or you can play as um, Jill. And you can also, I, I believe you can also like change their outfits. Ooh, yes, yeah, so you can get like the like Chris from the other games or Jill from the other games. I say you go, I mean, chat, maybe you might disagree with me, um, but I say you go Jill with the old school outfit. Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, that one. This one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This one. Or I don't know, I kind of like the dad hat, mm. dad hat Jill. Yeah, so know. people are saying Jill in chat. Uh, let me see. Uh, apparently you could play as either in the old one too. Yeah, see, I think you should go OG Jill. Yeah, I think that sounds right. Yeah, because it, yeah, it looks kind of silly. I mean, I, I dig the whole like military look. Yeah, the shoulder honestly. pads, her yeah. shoulders are safe, <laughs> you know? You got to protect them from the zombies. Facts. Zombies, right? It's about zombies. Yeah, it's yeah. about, this is about the dead. The Walking oh, Dead. The oh walking no, the wrong game. Sorry. Uh, <laughs> too soon. Too soon. Yeah, my bad. Uh, <laughs> yeah, let's go. OG Jill. Cool. Boom. Jill Valentine. Jill Valentine. <sighs> so when I was a kid and I first saw this game at a friend's house, mm -hmm. uh, I was afraid to then go to the hallway, <laughs> his empty hallway in the dark, and go to the bathroom. And this gave me nightmares as a kid. It scared the hell out of me. Okay, let me shut up. Alpha team is flying around the forest zone, situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Yeah, let us know if you want the uh, game audio to be a little louder. Bizarre recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently oh, eaten. Eaten? That's not good. Silent Hill 2 Bravo also gave me nightmares, by the way. To investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo Team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Poor Kevin. <laughs> We continued our search this for the fucking other asshole. Shades at night. And it what kind turned of... into <laughs> I mean, come on, we, we have Tim. <laughs> That's true. <laughs> oh, wow. That's interesting. I'm going to read some of these chat responses in a second. Mm-hmm. This is like, I think this is an FMV they added to the GameCube remaster, by the way. Yeah, the OG opening cutscene, I, I agree, is much better. If you haven't seen that, we'll YouTube it later, too. All right. YouTube it after the stream, y'all. I'll do that. Yeah, the, the the OG one had actual live screen. I mean, live action actors. It was live action. It was live action, like wow. a motherfucker. Huh, it's really interesting. I wonder why they changed it. I guess I thought it would age better, you know. 
like like the live action shit does not age well <laughs> but it's it's hilarious to watch like Is it's it like campy yeah it's super stuff. campy totally <clears throat> and i guess they could do more with the cgi you know like with the dogs and mm. the action I'm actually curious to see which one they inc they have to include the OG Resident Evil in the PlayStation Classic that's coming out. So if you if you wind up buying that, you'll get the one with the the OG cutscenes, which are freaking hilarious. Yeah, the live action is so cheesy. Chris this way. Chris this way. That's why I say to Chris person all the time. Remember, I'm like, let's get lunch. <laughs> Let's go toward the big scary mansion. That'll solve everything. It'll be safe in there. So I wanted to highlight this comment by JW Rose 13. The original RE game was the reason I bought a memory card. I picked it up on release day. I thought I could enjoy the game without being able to save it. You was wrong. That was dumb. I replayed the first 15 minutes like four times, then I drove back to the store for a memory card. Yeah, man. Memory oh, cards. Man. Kids, ask your parents about memory cards. What are those? Yeah, and someone else also pointed out that like this came out what six years after the original, and it looked so much better. Hmm. Not quite your ordinary house, that's for yeah, it's sure. Actual kind of amazing. How fast hey, Whisker, video game where's Chris? Let's move these days. Jill, no. You don't want to go back out there. Jill, no. Jill, no. We've got to find. What was that? Chris. No. Here we go. Jill, go and investigate. I'm going with her. Chris and I go back a long way. All right, you two go. I'll secure this area. Yeah, I still have all my memory cards too. Like I'm saving onto those saves for like whatever reason, like mm -hmm. some sort of weird preservation. Like I gotta save this siphon filter game save. Yeah, those were all proprietary too, right? Sony and their deal with their uh, only usable on PlayStation. Yeah. Memory cards. A dining room. A dining room. Oh, here we go. Okay, so let's let's L try out this control scene. What? Yeah, man. What? Look at that tank control, what dog. What the heck? Yeah. What is this? Get used to it. Oh Contem my god. Contemplate it. Just contemplate it. Just sit down and contemplate it. Wait, how do? Yeah, yeah. Yep. Walk towards that thing on the table that wants you to pick it up so bad, bro. I'm trying. Yeah, yeah, Paul. yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. There you go. There you go. There you go. Oh yeah. Okay, so... Oh, so you can do the quick turnaround. H how, how down an X. Down an X. Try down an X. Oh, how did you turn around so quickly? How are you doing that? I have no idea. <laughs> oh, oh, I think this is the right joystick. Oh, so that's a quick turnaround. Yeah. All right, that's good to know. Okay, okay. Yeah, the, look at those sweet, Whoa, sweet what? tank controls. Oh, yeah, my God. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. And oh, the, my God. The camera cuts, bro. You don't have control of the camera. That is... This is so weird. Yeah, wait until you're running away from something. Okay. I'm moving, but I don't know how I'm moving. So anytime you press up, uh -huh. she moves forward. Anytime I press up, she okay. moves forward. And then anytime you hit right, it's to always the relative to character her. model. Right. It's okay. always relative to the way she's facing. Okay, okay. This is amazing. I'm so I'm enjoying this moment so much, Song, you have no idea. It's very beautiful. So then Can I move sideways? You cannot move sideways. Oh my god, this is this is wrinkling my brain. Yeah, man. All right, so I have to go turn around, move forward. Yep. Turn. No, turn the other way. Yeah, this game turn. this game has aged so well because of like all the kind of decisions that were made around this game that uh -huh. like the, I mean visually at least, right? Like it, it has aged so well. So, I will say I'll I'll extend you a lifeline. Right. If you can't if you if you don't want to do this, you can always go to the alternate controls. No, I want to try. You want to try to learn it. All right, I want to cool. try to learn for a little bit. I respect it. I respect okay, it. Okay, so I go here. Pick up that. So, so here's the first Turn. thing you're gonna learn. That okay. that thing on the table, right? There's a typewriter there. It's right. framed perfectly. Um, see the thing on the left? They're glowing. They they don't want you to miss that. Uh -huh. So try to try to make your way to that little ink ribbon. I believe it's the ink ribbon. Just and go I'm over standing, to it. I'm literally standing right in front of it. And you're hitting X. Boom. Will you yes. take the ink ribbon? And then I feed it into the typewriter. Yeah, man. Feed it. Oh, my God. Feed it into the type typewriter. Oh, so there aren't any, like, prompts. 
that pop up on screen. I just have to like manually interact with. Oh yeah, I guess that's true. That's true. Yeah, there aren't any prompts. Yeah, it's how do I interact with? Okay, it's, it's an, an old, old typewriter. typewriter. You can save your progress. Oh. Use the ink ribbon. <laughs> yes. Cool. So you need ink ribbons to save. Are they? Um, do they disappear after you save? Yeah. Ooh. Welcome to Resident oh, Evil. Boy. <laughs> Yeah, it actually kind of feels like I'm a baby <laughs> taking my first steps. In it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, man. so J Rose is saying eventually you you get more fluid with the tank controls. You will get kind of used to it. You'll you'll kind of you'll get it. But imagine yeah. this is like imagine you're basically teleporting. I mean, with the exception of like it, this being the remaster of the original OG version, uh -huh. this is like what you would have experienced. In what was it, 96? Chat, can chat help me out? I think it was 96 when it came take out. A look at this. What is it? Blood. Did he Kill taste it? See if you the can fuck, find man? Any other clues. I'll be examining this. All right, so we gotta find some clues. <clears throat> Where is You okay. know, between Red Dead Redemption 2 and this, I'm really getting my fill of uh, janky game controls <laughs> this week. I, I, I put up a, on our stream, um, also the, the stream I did with Khalif last week, I talked about switching Red Dead controls, like the preset to a first-person shooter, uh -huh. and it changes, up, it changes up everything. Also, like raising up the sensitivity and then turning up the, the slow camera pan thing right. all the way up, that makes a huge difference. You also move a little faster in first person, I've, I've discovered. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I, think I can't play that game in first person, though. Are we still talking about RDR2? Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, it looks... I like to play in first person, just because I like looking at, I don't know, like, the vistas better. Yeah, I just need a, wi I need a wider field of view for first person. Yeah, I can't sense. be, like, on a... Thir I mean... This is film speak, but I can't be like on a 35 millimeter lens. I need to be like on a 16 at least. Like, mm -hmm. I need to look around. It needs to look like almost like a Beastie Boys video or something. Hmm. So, um, yeah, I'm curious about what chat, how chat feels about the uh, the PS1 classic because I feel like the game selection was kind of like, at least to me, I was like, oh okay, I, I'm fine. Like, I, I wasn't like, oh snap, I gotta play all these games. Um, but there were a couple that I felt like were missing, like even like Silent Hill or like I, th I don't think Wipeout's in there. Like someone mentioned Wipeout before. Mm -hmm. I'm like, damn. Okay, so now you're you're on the hunt for clues for clues, right? Yes. I'm just so. looking for shiny things that I can press X on, oh, or maybe not. What's this? When the two have run each other through, the path to your destiny will open. I wonder Tony what Hawk. That means. Someone said Tony Hawk. That's great. Haplar, that's actually really accurate to the, to the feelings that I'm experiencing right now. Wait, what is it? So you don't actually control Jill. You actually play as a tiny mouse inside Jill's brain controlling oh. her two giant lovers. Right, that's canon. I think that's canonical. Wait, really? No. Oh. Um, <laughs> I actually heard a really good podcast recently. I forget what it's called, but it, it, it told you the history of grandfather clocks. <laughs> Uh -huh. And like where it comes from, and it sounds boring, but it's actually kind of interesting. Uh, apparently, it comes from like a, a song some guy wrote about a grandfather clock, like in the early 1900s or late, eight, or yeah, early 1900s. Uh -huh. And it was like a, a smash hit. Like apparently, it was like a it was like the equivalent of like a top 40 smash hit at the time. Oh. And uh, he refers to the clock as grandfather's clock, and it just sort of shortened down to grandfather clock. Oh, interesting. I didn't know that. Learn something new every day. Yeah. From my grandpa? <laughs> <laughs> a large filth and crusted jar. Okay. Yo, demo discs used to straight up. If I had a demo disc and I had a demo of a game, I was like, yo, I got that game. Mm -hmm. Even if it was like a 15 minute slice, it's like, I got this game. I played the demo for games like, you have no idea. Do you remember uh, cereal box games? Yeah, like Chex Quest? Chex Quest. I actually uh, started playing Roller Coaster Tycoon because it came inside a box of cereal. Oh, that's dope, actually. That's pretty cool. Yeah, and now it's my favorite game of you all time. You love that game. Yeah, yeah that's that's cool awesome. Game. I can't go up. Is this, is this a door? I'm not seeing... <laughs> oh, oh. 
Yeah, look at wow. that, bro. I found something. Look at the door animation, bro. <laughs> Yo, as a kid, that f- that messed me up. It was like, whoa, we just cut and we're walking through a door. Uh, but you know what? I'm still like, instinctually like using the right joystick to try and move the camera. No, nah, man. No, you gotta let it go. Oh man, let oh, it go. Poor. Is this way back down? Did I just come up there? No, you, you you always remember where she's in relation to where she's facing, right? Yeah, um, yeah. This game came out with no analog sticks, if I'm not mistaken. Oh. Like you only had a D-pad. Oh my God, that would have been torture. Or maybe it would have been better. I don't know. It's locked. An emblem of armor was carved into the lock. All right, so we got a nice little uh, clue sequence here. Okay. Oh, oh my God. Oh my God. Yeah, dude. <sighs> yeah, dude. Where are you going? <gasps> stairs. Stairs. Bro. Stairs. Can you navigate the stairs? Our greatest enemy. <laughs> stairs. Okay, I have successfully. Can you play with the D-pad? Actually, can you move around with the D-pad? Yeah. Yo, oh play, yeah. Yo, play I with can. the D-pad. Play with the D-pad. Is that better? No, I'm just like, let's make it authentic, old school. <laughs> All right, I have moved from the left joystick to the D-pad. Let's see how it goes. It's, it's locked. locked. Sword. Okay. So any key information will always be highlighted a different color or whatever. Right. So it, I think it said like an emblem with a sword or something. Yeah. So, and before that was an emblem of armor of some sort, so. Oh, wow, that's crazy. I didn't know that. Strawberry in chat says uh, they had to release a version with analog support. Still tank controls, though. That's interesting. Right. Okay, back up the stairs. Down this way. What else is, what else is there to do up here? I think we checked this door already. Yep. Emblem of armor, so that's the, it's another locked door that needs something to get through. I believe there is a run button, if I'm not mistaken. There is? Wait, you're telling me this now? There's a run button? I only just remembered that because uh, Sean in chat, oh wait, no, it wasn't Sean. Um, Ghost Little. Oh, there, there you there go. We go. It's uh, square. We did it, y'all. Nice. We, we went from crawling to walking. <laughs> All right, now I'm gonna turn around. Oh my God, this is, wait, okay, there. <laughs> there you go, there you go, you'll get it. You'll get it, buddy. You'll get it, buddy. Oh yeah, yeah. hit yeah. those walls, bro. Okay, this is. <laughs> wow, that's crazy, you had to release a DualShock version. That's wild, I don't remember that, that's crazy. Yeah, it's a speed run now, boys. Let's yeah, let's do it. Wait, 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 wait. You okay, you wanna go back there? Oh, that was, is this going back down? It's going back to where you came from. I'm gonna help you out a little bit. I'm gonna oh. gently guide you to where oh, you need please, to go. But please do. Go back up. Yeah, yeah. Get out of here. Yeah. Barry just still licking blood. Like, yeah, that's Heinz ketchup. Yeah, I I agree. I feel like using alternate controls is kind of weird. Like, I wouldn't want to play this game without the tension of being like, "Fuck! I gotta turn around slowly and hit this wall while I try to escape." Okay, so you already went this way, right? Uh -huh. When you remember where you entered this hallway. This hallway? Yeah, that hallway right there. You you could you could move in one direction, but there seemed to be like there was room in the, oh. the other direction. Oh, interesting. That's that's a solid hint. All right, let's run the other way. This game is like uh, also obsessive with the the camera cuts and the way things are framed. So oh. that's I would also say that's a a big hint is like always just observe everything if you can. We found this. Let's see what's in it. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh shit! What do I do? What do I do? No, no, no! Shit! No. Room of. Ah! Ah! It's like. <laughs> God damn! <laughs> It's a zombie! Yo, when I first saw this, oh my god! Okay, As running, a kid, I was traumatized. Uh, wait, I, I can't keep, I can't keep. Yeah, yeah. Yep. It's, 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 it's a dead end. It's it, a dead end. No, it's gonna come after you. But look, you have a thing. How do you I can use, use it? Maybe, uh, maybe go for some help. 
Or you can figure out how to, yeah, you can go back to uh, a, a maybe someone, a coworker, a colleague. <laughs> okay, Paul, I, I, I see what you're dropping. I see what you're dropping. <laughs> <laughs> if you need to, if you can get, if, if you I can, can get if to I can them, do that. You might just have to like juke. You can also like, whoop. Oh, nope, wrong way. No, J Rose, we already used the the ribbon. It's it's too late. Oh! Oh no! Ah! Ah! Get him! Get him! Oh, nice, nicely done. Nope, nope. You don't want to go towards him. Yep, you want to go away from him. Oh yeah, 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 yeah! Run! <laughs> <laughs> oh my God! I can't. I just go forward. Oh, who is calling me right now? I'm, I'm, this was the door, right? Yep. Oh my God, that uh, <sighs> that. That low moan still gives me nightmares. Yeah, I might volunteer to murk, murk a zombie eventually. Look out! It's a monster! Look out! It's a monster! Yeah, oh Barry don't God. play though. Take care of it. Barry got the blicky with the sticky. I don't think that's I hold a pistol. Then you have to get a wide stance, bend your knees. I found Kenneth killed by this thing. Uh -oh. Let's report this to Wesker. <sighs> okay. Okay. Um, yeah, Barry got the technique down. So I'm gonna go back to the joystick because I think that's that works a little. Oh bit yeah. Okay. Yeah, the joystick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I've been playing on the D-pad. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go. <laughs> Wait. So here's a hint, right? Uh huh. That room in. I think. I think this is a hint. But remember the, where you just came from? Yeah. Maybe there. Maybe it might be worth investigating. Ooh. A little tip. All right, let's go back. This is so. This is such a beautiful moment, everybody. I'm so glad you're here to witness this with me. Oh, I can't. I physically. Oh, can't you have get to go to back to the Wesker. Okay. Yeah. The story is uh, pushing me in a certain direction. Right, get out of my way! Thank you. Oh yeah, not yet. I'm getting. I'm getting ahead of myself. <laughs> All right, back to Wesker. This way, right? Yep. Open the door. Open the door. Thank you. No, open the door. Oh, man. <laughs> so, I love how the people are like, I'm on the edge of my seat. <laughs> Wesker! Wesker! Help me look for him. Oh, no. I, I also remember, like, the... Maybe chat, maybe some of the uh, people who play the OG version on PlayStation can rem can also agree that, like, I remember the mansion looking way different on the OG version. Like it didn't look like this at all. I mean, it looks so similar, but mm -hmm. they really like they really updated it with like a lot of detail for the GameCube remaster. Better finish searching the hall. That's what I'm trying to do. Yeah, it was a lot simpler. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, so it wasn't it wasn't just like a graphics upgrade. They changed like, layouts and th layouts and stuff. I think they might have like slightly adjusted layouts. I don't I don't think they like drastically changed things but there there it was a lot of it was a lot simpler and i remember it being like a little like i still remember it being looking like this when i when i played the original but i'm sure it doesn't uh -huh. um I don't, I don't think you could run behind the stairs in the og version that's interesting okay so they might have changed some yeah they probably changed a lot of layout diddy diddy came in and was like eh -eh, eh -eh. <laughs> Because Diddy totally produced this game. Yeah, he he was the creative director in my in my mind. All right, go up the stairs. <laughs> is that what you've been trying to do? <laughs> I've this been whole trying time? to go up the stairs this whole time. <laughs> That's hilarious. <laughs> no, don't go back down. No, Wait, no, 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 Jill, Jill, you can do it, Jill. Go on, up Jill. the stairs. Yeah, girl. Go up the stairs. Yeah, girl. Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, okay. Oh no, no, no. Uh, up, up. Oh my god, up. man. No, not you, down. You'll, you'll get not it. Down. You'll uh. get it. You're gonna no, get it. No. <laughs> You're gonna get it, man. Yeah, turn around. I believe in you, Sung. Turn up. Yeah, 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 no. Yeah, yeah. no. No, 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 no. <laughs> turn up. Up. Okay. There you go. Sometimes you gotta take it slow, you know, like in real life. Take it slow, baby. Like just like John Legend said, take it slow. Uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. Let's go this way. <laughs> stair climbing. Stair climbing simulator. Yeah. Yeah, you see, this is why I argue for the D-pad is because you could just press up. So I think uh, what's what's messing you around is the analog input is like slowly steering to the right or left. That might be it. All right. 
Going back to the D pad. Gotta go back to the OG. Uh, Paul, have you seen the scenes from uh, I'm Still Here where Joaquin, Joaquin? Joaquin, Joaquin Phoenix, Phoenix is trying to be a rapper. I did actually, and I w I was confused if that. So he's talking about uh, where Joaquin Phoenix is in, is in the studio with Diddy, and I was like, was that scripted? Was that real? It looked real, but I'm like, I you know, Diddy's also been in a couple comedies and stuff, so I wouldn't be surprised if it was at least improvised and they had a premise. But mm -hmm. I I mean, everyone thought back in the day like he was actually trying to do this thing, but apparently it was just like a one really. Oh my! Oh shoot! That scared the crap out of me. Your reflection? Yeah, my reflection. <laughs> yeah, dog. Oh man! So um, last night, actually, I uh, took a tour of uh, what the New York Times apparently claimed once is the most haunted house in uh, New York oh, City. Oh yeah, I saw that on your Instagram story. I did not see any paranormal things, but um, definitely was a weird energy to that house. But they're like, really? but but everyone apparently in that house, like, they didn't die like a, a pretty awful death. I think one, or, I think a few of them might have died of some sort of sickness, but like uh -huh. everyone else just was just chilling. So I think they were just like chill ghosts. So, so I mean, they're happy ghosts. They're just chilling. Yeah. 999 just... happy haunts with room for one more. <laughs> Sorry, Disney reference. Okay. 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 I just got back from Disney World. So. Oh my God. That's really scary. Actually. The most frightening. The most frightening thing to you is getting back from Disney World. Yeah. For Disney World is actually Loki. Loki kind of scary. Disney's Loki kind of scary though. I mean like I like Disney because it's like you go there and you're like, oh my god, my childhood, yay! And you're like, anything is possible with the fireworks. Mm -hmm. I also don't want to slander too Disney too much on the stream, but uh, <laughs> kind of spooks me out a little bit. I'll leave it at that. Yeah, it does seem. It, it can seem definitely like pretty artificial. Yeah. And uh, as someone who used to be a cast member there for oh, a year, yeah. I, I totally. Get That's what amazing. That comes from. What uh, What were you a cast member? Do you um, might, Do you want to talk about it? Oh, I can talk about okay. it. Okay. <laughs> I don't want to like. <laughs> Um, <clears throat> I, I worked at one of the resorts. Um, I was in food and beverage, so okay, basically a really fancy way of saying a uh, burger flipper. But like, did you have to be like in character and shit, or were you like, "Hey, kids, a, a character as a burger"? You flipper? want a burger? Or are you are you in the back? You were like not uh, not customer back, facing. Back in front, um, yeah, like there are guidelines being like, "Oh, you have to be happy. You have to take care of your guests and all that." Guests always come See, first. I can't do that, man. So I have a bad day. I'm just like, I'm just on, I'm just chilling, I'm coasting. Uh -huh. I can't always be on. Right. Okay. So I'm, I'm trying every door in here and. Keep trying, man. Oh, but remember, there was also uh, another set of stairs. That's all I'll say. Another set of stairs. On the ground level. Yeah. Oh, Gak, man. You also worked at Disney. It was not fun. Were you at a uh, Disneyland or Disney World? Or the world? Were West you Coast, on Coast. the land or in the world? All right, searching for another set of stairs. Oh, I love Knott's Berry Farm. I used to live kind of like 15 minutes away from that place. So I used to go there all the time. It's like, it's a great theme park. Oh, he's Disneyland. And That's West Coast, right? It is. All right, trying that door, nothing. Right, stairs, right, stairs, stairs, stairs. So you try, you try all the doors on this level, right? Nothing yeah, worked. Okay. Nothing here. So let's head back to the ground level. Okay. Oh. If you, if you can do it. <laughs> stairs. <laughs> Song's <laughs> greatest foe. <laughs> the stair. The step. Okay, it's really hard with a, with a perspective because I can't tell like if yeah, man. she's positioned properly to go down the stairs or not. No, no, no. There, there you go. Yeah, oh. yeah, yeah. Yes. Yes. One step at a time. Riveting stream. <laughs> Ten controls. No. No. Down, down, down. Down. Okay. Down one more. Oh, you mean the stairs going down to uh, the basement, I see? Mm hmm. Ugh, you Barry. never want to go down to the basement. Barry. No, nothing. What's going on around here? I can't figure it out. Same here. Chris, and now Wesker. There's not much we can do. So is the voice acting the separate. same from the original? Or is it all remastered? No, I think it's all I think it's all been updated. I remember the original voice acting being terrible. I could be wrong though. Okay, wait, so the the game is pushing me to go through a door on this level. Do you still want me to go down to the basement? Is that still something I want to do? I almost forgot. Uh we'll see what they say. You'd make better use of it. I'm gonna check something real quick. Yeah. Oh my god, imagine if RDR2 had tank controls. Oh god. Jesus Christ. 
Lockpick. Thanks. Nice. I may need it. Listen, if something happens, let's meet up in this hall. Got it? Okay. You know what, though, Paul? Like, honestly, I'm really enjoying this. Yeah? Part. Yeah. That's awesome. Like, this, um, like, atmospheric, creepy horror thing, like, it's, it's right, it's right up my alley. Yeah, and, and like, this, this game in particular does a pretty good job of, like, maintaining this pace, but also just, like, adding just enough. Like, it trickles it in until the very ridiculous ending. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Now it's getting interesting. Oh, boy. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, I see something shiny. Come mm -hmm. to me, shiny thing. Hmm. Hello, statue. It's also, I think you'd like this game because there are, like, puzzles littered throughout the game. Mm. And some of them are, like, really <clears throat> basic. Like, I have a key now. But other ones are like, huh, if I, maybe if I look at this differently. Wait, how do I get to that shiny thing? Can I jump? No, I can't jump. Um, all right, I'll go around. Oh. Oh. I stood up on this. Okay. 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 All right. That, that's something. That's a start. Yeah. Oh, oh, look what you did, bro. Oh. I have a sinking feeling. I, I have a sinking feeling that something is going to happen. Okay, it's just an eerie picture of the mansion. Is that a, is is this a door? So now I'm not going to help you out now. Okay, fine. I don't need. You. <laughs> <laughs> I'm oh, gonna, I'm gonna let you swim, man. <clears throat> yeah, yeah, yeah. <gasps> okay, shiny thing. Ooh, I will take the dagger. Using defensive items such as daggers. Okay. To equip a defensive item, go to the status screen and select an item from the defensive item menu and select equip. Press L2. So okay. you, you might want to practice, you know? Yeah, I also don't want to spoil the puzzles here, so I'm going to... Keep it very vague if you need a hint. Okay. Equip weapon. Mm-hmm. Exit. And now I can press L2. Well, I assume not now because I'm... But you're saying there is a puzzle in this room. There is. Yeah. Not in this room, but in this area. Okay. But you should be able to swing now. Like, try hitting L2 and then R2. Oh. There's a map. Hello, map. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, let me go back into my status screen. <clears throat> oh, defensive items were new to the remake. That's interesting. I did not know that. Hmm. Yeah, so my dagger is equipped. Right. Which means I should be able to press L2. Oh, yes. Oh, the defensive items only work when being attacked. So oh, that's my okay, bad. Yeah, I thought you could swing it. That makes sense. All right. Back out we go. I keep um, instinctually reverting to the uh, joystick. Whoa, whoa. Oh God. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hit him! Hit this fool! Yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you okay, go. Ulti, ulti. Ooh. Ooh. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh God. Oh God. Oh God. Oh, oh God. Was I supposed Ooh. to run? Yep. Get out of there. Get out of there. Run, son. I mean, you also got another knife uh, just in case, but you want to get out of there. No. No. Ah. Yes. Ah. Yes. Ah. Okay, there you go. Get out of there. <clears throat> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, no, you can I, also I just shoot him, too, if you want to learn how to sh use your gun. Um. Oh. Ring around the rosy. I mean, I assume I will have to learn how to shoot eventually, right? Can you, uh... Yeah, I mean, I would definitely try to handle that zombie. Okay. If you can. Well, I don't know if I... Like, I just left the room, so now I don't know if I, if I, do I, if I go back in. Let's see. Yeah, tank controls really add to the tension, man. How did people play this? Oh, no, no, turn around. Okay. Right, right, right. To... So you can, uh, so you can, uh, can you equip your knife? This one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Equip it. 
Okay. If you want, or you can try to like learn how to shoot him. I think you should learn how to try to learn how to shoot him. I I assume it's L two. I mean, also you do want to kind of reserve. It's a th this is your uh, this is your ultimate decision throughout the course of the game too. Is like when to use your knife versus your gun, right? Because you do want to conserve ammo because ammo is very uh, limited. Okay. But I'll let well, you. I'll let you live your best life. <laughs> I'm gonna try the gun, especially since I don't think we have a lot of time left on this stream, anyways. Okay. Okay. Oh, how do? How yeah. Oh, he's how like he's I, set up for you, bro. How do I shoot? How do I shoot? Honestly, I don't. I don't. I forgot. Just try, just punch it. Oh. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Get in your stance. Get in the get in the Vice City stance. There you go. Yeah, dude. And if nice. you you can also aim up if you're close enough, like when they get within range, and you can just pop one right in, right in their head. I don't I don't know if you'd be able to do it there, but okay. How many shots does it take? Find out. Oh, oh you got it. Nice. Okay, so can I loot? Is there a loot <laughs> function in this game? Uh, I don't think so. I don't remember <laughs> there being one, but yeah, you can also try shooting his head. Like when you're aiming. Uh huh. Um, oh yeah, if if you aim, because uh, sometimes they might actually still be alive when you try to walk by. But I don't think you need to go back into that room anyway. But there right. is a there is a thing in this room that you need. <laughs> okay, let's get that thing. Which is, I, I'm assuming it's the shiny thing, right? So Maybe. I'm going to. Come on, <laughs> it is. Don't, don't, don't be that guy. It could be. <laughs> All right. So I'm assuming I need to push this, right? In some way, shape, or form. That's an option. When I used to play games with my brother, mm -hmm. uh, and he knew the solution, or if I knew the solution and the other one didn't, we we just refused to help each other out. It'd be like, Nah, man, figure it out. <laughs> figure it out. I pushed this before, so I know it's possible. Yeah. I'm blanking on how to do it. Or maybe it's it's like only pushable from one side. Right. In right. which case I need to no. Remember when you when you came back out? Yeah. I need to jump up. Jump back down. Jump. Go back down. Go back down. Thank you. Turn around. There we go. Nice, Boom. nicely done. Have yeah, fun with yeah, your yeah. lunch, J W Rose. Right, yeah, I wonder what they had for here. lunch. Okay. Oh, today it's a pet. It's a pet thai. Oh yeah, I had some pet thai. I was talking about J Rose oh. though. Yeah, we'll play till two thirty because I, I I really wanna unless you have something pressing to go to address. Uh, not really. Let's just let's give the people some more of this historic. All right. All right, I stood up on this thing. And then I can take this. Can I? You might be like a foot off. Yes. Oh, you got it. Okay. Take it, of course. And boom. There you go. Oh, pizza sounds good right now. Oh, pizza. Yeah. That sounds great. You're making pizza? That's amazing. Making pizza actually um, is surprisingly easy. Oh, Easier yeah. Easier than you'd think. But you got to like get the dough. You got to knead the dough. Is that the right word? Needy. You're the, you're the food you're the food expert. All right, I'm just looking through this map right now. It's, oh, okay. Okay, okay, okay. You got the map. Dun 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 dun. <laughs> we got the thing. All right. Woman drawing. Oh, it's a uh, it's a statue. Okay. Jump down. Jump. Go down. Please. Can you can you go down for me? Will you please do that? Thank you. All right. Is there anything more to do in here? Do you have any uh, herbs you could use per by herbs? chance? Because you're you're holding your your gut there a little bit. Oh, oh, did you try that door already? Oh. I did not try that door. It's locked. It's locked. <clears throat> so I assume even though I have the uh, lock pick, I need something else to get through that door. Oh, that's amazing. Dice Game says they know someone who has a wood stove in their house. Damn. That's cool. I, I do not have any herbs, I don't think. But I am bleeding, it looks like. I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding. 
Yeah, you don't have anything yet. You just, you just gotta deal with it. You gotta walk it off. Alright, let's get let's get out of here. That's the other thing too, is like remember those ink ribbons? So anytime you see a a uh, typewriter, mm -hmm. definitely try to use those typewriters. Alright, sounds good. Cause because this game is like, what's an autosave? <laughs> Oh uh, yeah, I remember when games didn't have those. So I mean, just a heads up. Maybe, maybe save it now. I don't know, or or not, oh. Oh, or not. Okay. You okay. Could, so, could, so you're basically telling me to save now. Okay. Or on. keep keep going until we find another one and make uh -huh. the make the tension a little better for the stream. No, nah, that's right. You want to say okay? <laughs> you're like, nah, I'm not doing that <laughs> shit over again. <clears throat> yeah, we got a whole pizza chat going on in the uh, oh pizza chat, chat right now. It's pizza time. Yeah. Oh, and by the way, for pizza cheese, I found that the best mixture is 70% grated mozz. Like, not not the fancy mozz, like the pizza cheese mozz you get like from the, the store. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. And then maybe some like grated cheddar or gruyere works really nicely. Oh. Top it with some slices of... Um, you got to dry it out, though, with, with the actual mozz because... Um, it has a lot of liquid in it, and that causes like the crust to get a little soggy in the oven. Interesting. So how yeah. do you dry it out? Just squeeze it between some uh, paper towels. That's what I always do. That's amazing. Did not know that. Yeah, pizza's great. Uh, if you backtrack, you get herbs. Don't mean to spoil stuff, but don't want him to die prematurely. Oh, really? So where where can we find these herbs? Oh, oh maybe about... where Chris died? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like that room where we encountered the first zombie. Yeah, let's investigate. Yeah. I mean, let's save see. first. Yes. We have the memory card into our PlayStation right now, so we're good. <laughs> Overwrite that. Not those kind of herbs, <laughs> dice game. Settle down. That would be kind of cool. Yeah. Oh, there you go. You just helped out a, 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 a viewer. Nice. Follow my Instagram. Yeah, follow his Instagram. <laughs> Seriously, it's all food. What is it again? Um, so I have two. Um, I have a main one, and then I have one for just my cooking. What's the cooking one? It's a little hard to say it out loud. It's. Um, <clears throat> I'll, I'll type it in chat. Sure. It's the underscore unprofessional underscore cook. The underscore underprofessional. Un unprofessional. Unprofessional. Yeah, there you go. Pause typing it right now. <laughs> Underscore. Cook. Cook. Yeah. Go follow our boy. <gasps> you heard that. Uh-oh. Did you uh -oh. hear that? Oh. Yeah, you might want to be ready. Knife. Let's N try the knife. Knife's not a bad option. Also, you just saved, so. Right. Wait, what happened to my uh, defensive knife? Did I lose it when I fought that zombie? Yeah, you stabbed it right in his noggin. Oh. I don't know if you get the, the, those kind of knives back, those little daggers. I could be wrong. Chat, help me out. Ooh, with the quick turnaround, the 180. Okay, so that's how you that's how you stab, stabby stab. Slice, slice. Thank you for the follow. Comment, like, and subscribe. Okay, search his body. Can you search his body? The his body time. Comrade Kenneth. Bottom size machine. Okay, video player, or a film, I guess. I need a video player. All right, let's look for herbs. Oh wait, was there a room back there? Yeah, there was. I, I was. I just wanted to check this corner. It'll be like it'll be apparent. Like it'll glow. Ooh, door. <gasps> oh man, it's such a tense animation. Video game doors are freaking scary, man. In fact, I think we actually had an article on Kotaku.com about it. Oh, look Wait, at these why is, angles, bro. This is great. Why is this? Why? Why is it suddenly uh, tilted? That's scary. Dutch angles are usually a. Oh, you you missed a magazine back there, right by the bird cage. A magazine? Uh, clip. Uh, gun oh. clip. I'm using old Rainbow Six lingo. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> right, let's pick that up. Cool. See, oh, magazine. They say it too. Nice. Oh, so I assume your gun doesn't like auto reload? Mm mm. Man, nineties. <clears throat> herbs. I used to say herbs as a kid. 
Also, my mm-hmm. brother used to call me a herb all the time. That is <laughs> not a, that is not an endearing term. You and your brother seem to have a pretty good relationship. Yeah, you know, older brother. <laughs> One more herb slash herb. There you go. Yo, shout out to who 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 gave us the the yeah, Gag Man. Shout out to you for this uh, pro tip. <laughs> okay, so now that you have herbs yes. or herbs as they're called, uh, you can use them. Now you're in the yellow. Wait, where are you seeing the yellow? Oh, oh. That's your health. Oh. What do you think? What do you think? That I just was? thought it was some just I some weird yeah some decoration <laughs> for the <laughs> for the item menu. Diddy was like, "Go ahead, add that right there." <laughs> <laughs> okay, so can I use one more? Like, will, yeah, will that get sure. me to the green? Yeah, get you in the green. Oh, I'm fine. Oh, well, thanks. Guide your counter. Or whatever it is. Oh, uh, yeah. You have, you have to collect the lighter. <laughs> it's a paper for green <laughs> herbs that says okay. little. Okay. Little, okay. Yeah, Calm yeah. down. This is a PG stream. Relatively. We are playing Resident Evil. So. Yeah, I know. All right. We have 15 more minutes to make some magic happen. Oh, look I, at that window. <gasps> Diddy was like, yeah, Dutch Angles. Eh, eh. I like that. You know what movie you should watch if you if you like Dutch Angles? Hmm. Um, oh, man, I'm blanking on it now. It was the John Travolta Scientology movie, Battlefield Earth. Oh, my God. No, thanks. <laughs> I think I saw the trailer for that as a kid, and I was like, no, nah, I'm good. But I will, I actually, you know what? I'll watch it. Because now I like watching campy. bad things. It's yeah. incredibly campy. It's incredibly bad. <gasps> it's so bad. But it has Dutch Angles up the wazoo, so... All right, reflection mirror. Hello, can I interact with you? No. I like in Red Dead you can insult yourself in the mirror. You're like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did like that. That game is filled with like so many like little hidden details and touches. Come on, from the other side, lock pick. Use. What? Really? What did what did it say again when you tried to open the door? Um. Oh, there you go. I mean, that's what a lockpick is for, <laughs> right? Is is that not what lockpicks do? It might be barricaded. <gasps> Alright, let's move on. Ooh, oh, 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 hit him! Oh, oh. oh. I'm, I'm, no! try, I'm trying. I'm trying. Kick his ass. Slice him. Slice him and dice 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 him. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. There you go. Like a pizza! Like a pizza! Oh! Ah. This might be it! Get him! Get off me! Poke him again! Poke him again! Use your gun, too! Yeah, I was just about to, uh... Load up the magazine. So wait, go to the magazine. Okay. Click it. Use. Use. Oh, wait. Combine? Maybe? I think you have to do it while you have it equipped. I haven't played this game in, like, 20 years. Combine. Okay, equip this. There you go. Oh. It's yo. Let's go. All right. Wait. Why, why am I still holding a knife? You gotta equip it. <sighs> this game. Yeah, dude. Shoot him. Shoot him. Shoot him in the head. You can aim up too. How do I aim up? I don't know. I forgot. Well, I think did you not push up while you were aiming? Uh, actually, I didn't. Try That's that. Yeah. Good idea. Okay. Well, looks like looks like I need more herbs. Th- oh, so someone said there was herbs probably back there. Go turn, turn go back around that corner. Uh huh. Also, what's crazy is when you first started out that, uh, you could you could see that zombie in the mirror there. Oh, you could? I thought it was a portrait, but apparently it was oh. a fucking zombie. Wait, so where are the herbs? Oh, I don't know. Someone said there was. Maybe go back to the other other room. Hopefully that zombie. This this guy is probably alive. Shoot him in the butt cheek just to make sure. Just tap, just give him a love tap and aim down. Yeah, yeah, dude. Oh. Am I aiming? Yeah, I, don't, I think you shot the floor next to him. Try to, yeah, yeah, yeah. There you go. Okay, he might be dead. He might be dead. Oh, herb, herb right there. Oh. oh, look at all the herbs. So many herbs. Look at all the herbs. <laughs> yeah, get the oregano, get all that. Got the basil. Got the basil. Got the I love basil. Basil's great. Yeah, the dill, dill super good too. Thank you again to G Ma- Jack Gackman. Yeah, thank you. He's, he's the er, he's the herb man. <laughs> he's our pusher man. 
Oh, so you want to use them? Oh, right. Danger. Okay. Use. Oh wait, someone said you could combine them. I forgot what? you could do that. Herb strats. Next time, next time. <sighs> there are plenty of herbs in this in this mansion. I'm gonna get more pad thai if there's more downstairs. Oh yeah, there were like four trays of it. Oh hell really yeah, fun. that was really good. Shout out to Curtis Mayfield, indeed. Always getting my references. What's that reference to? I'm your pusher man. It's an oh. old song. <gasps> oh, shiny. Oh, what's shiny. that? What could that be? What's this? What's this? There's something in the air. <laughs> <laughs> Golden arrow. Okay. We'll gladly take that. Okay. To examine an item, select the examine command. Oh, what's that in the corner? Ooh, thank you. Thank you. Yes, I will. Lovely. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, let's check out this uh, golden arrow. Examine. Just a, just a regular run-of-the-mill golden arrow with like a jade tip mm, or whatever. Interesting. So what I'm theorizing is there's a door somewhere that's locked, and it says, like, oh, there's a symbol with an arrow in it, and then, boom, this unlocks it. Maybe. Aha, uh -huh, brains. Maybe. You might be onto something. Mm -hmm. But it looks like there's a little... I see it, I see it. I'm just trying okay. to nudge you along. We got ten minutes. I want to see some action. Uh-oh. There was a shadow. Or was that my shadow? I don't even know. <coughs> All right, two doors, a mirror. Let's, let's go left. What's behind door number one? Drum roll, please. Dun, 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 dun. It's locked on the other side. Dun, Can dun, I dun, use dun, my dun. lock, my lockpick? Dun, 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 no, I can't dun, dun, because lockpicks don't dun, dun. lock doors in this world. Tactical tank control action. Courageous nine and up. <laughs> you unlocked it, bro. All right. Get ready for some action. Okay, I'm gonna go into my. Yeah, combine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get ready. Oof. Here we go, bro. Oof. Uh oh. Okay, here we go. Yeah, square up, dog. Oh! Oh! No. Oh, okay. One shot. In. That was a good shot. Yeah. I think one of the uh, people in the in the chat said the game auto aims. Oh, okay, that's cool. That's so like great. auto locks on the on the fool. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Go, do, do, do it. And when he gets close, don't forget to aim up. Aim up. Oh. No. Oh. Because if you get lucky, sometimes they'll be. So here's a pro tip. Uh huh. Okay. I believe, if I'm not mistaken, maybe Gakman can can uh, correct me if I'm wrong. If you see the blood come out of them like that, that means they're definitely dead. Sometimes oh. if you don't though, they'll grab your ankle and they try try to oh, God. try to bite your shoelaces and stuff. All right, let's check the doors. It's locked. And then the sword. Yeah, we got gameplay. <laughs> yeah, hot action. You just went. You came oh, in there. Oh crap! I'm wait thirty minutes now to come back inside <laughs> here. Go back. Nope. Oh, turn around. Thank you. That is nice that they had the quick turnaround. I don't, I don't, I do not remember that quick turnaround being in the original. Mm -hmm. So uh, yeah, that's this simplifies things a lot. All right, that guy's still dead, thankfully. Or is he? All right, move forward, please. Thank you. Okay. Oh, what's that blue crystal? This game rules. Yeah, I'm really liking it. Although I will say that once this stream is done, and if I want to play this some more, I am definitely switching over to the regular, the, controls? The regular controls. No, man, yeah. it's part of the tension. <laughs> it's part of the tension. It's like Jill can't use her legs. Wait, can I fall if I go down here? I don't know. I mean, I don't know if you want I, to, though, for the stream I, purposes. True. All right, pressing X. Nothing's happening. Go around this statue. Nope. Turn around. Thank you. Nothing? Nothing. Nothing. Hmm. But you've encountered an obstacle like this before, haven't you? 
Why, yes, I have. And you Game design. And, and you learned a thing that you can do in order to potentially bring it to you, right? Mm-hmm. That's all I'm going to say. Wait, so you're saying I can push this? <laughs> let's see, let's see. She got some ice in her hand. Darn right she does. Oh. You could go that way. <sighs> Paul. <laughs> Come on, man. We got like seven minutes. I'm trying to make this hot. I'm trying to make it hot. You're like you're like me watching Avengers with my roommate for the first time. You're like, watch this part. Watch this part. Yeah. Okay. I'm pushing it the way you have so subtly directed me to push it. Um, I mean, you could go that way, too. Oh, wait. I got it. It clicked. It clicked. It clicked. Thank you, Paul. I don't no doubt. Okay. Push. Yep. Thank you. <laughs> and then I throw it down. I'm assuming. Nope. 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 No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Wait, why can't I? I'm, okay, so I'm trying to throw it down the banister. Okay. The floor. That's what I thought the solution was. Yeah. I can't do it for some reason. Oh, oh. Oh, she didn't do it. Never mind. Maybe try pushing it a little more this way. Like a little more towards. Oh, there you oh, go. There you it got it. You got there it. it goes. Okay, right. so you, you got that done, right? Right. So I'm just going to try and see if I can fall down. Nope. Nope. But there's still other doors you can check. That is true. If you go the other way. Right. I'm going to try running. Oh, again. yeah. I forgot you could run. Yeah. I haven't been running because I've been bumping into every freaking wall. And Just go push there. forward. <laughs> there we go. Okay. I got this. I got this. There you go. Ooh. Man, it's a workout. All right, so we are in this room now, which I think we've been to before. Yeah, yeah, this is the original second floor from the uh, main hall, I think. Yeah. Oh, yeah. This is where I got shocked by my own shadow, <laughs> which, oh, there it is. Yep, so when scary. you, the cool thing about this game is like when you, like, it's, it has that sort of Metroid-ish feeling to it where like, Oh, that's where I am now. I know where I am. Like, I, I entered this door before that was previously locked, but I came from the other side. Mm -hmm. So. Yeah, I love that feeling. Yeah. I, lo I just love Metroidvanias in general. And if anyone watching the stream has not played Hollow Knight yet, you totally should. I haven't played it yet. Paul. I'm sorry. Paul. I haven't gotten around to it yet. There's been so many games. I don't know if you know this, <laughs> but there's been so many games coming out lately. That's true. Oh, hey, now, Scooby-Doo is a great movie. Scooby Dooby Doo, where are you? That song is actually amazing. If you listen to it and you like think about it as a product of its time, mm -hmm. it sounds like this like Beatles sort of weird oh, yeah. experimentation. So, so I believe I have to go this mm, way. No, other way. Other way. Yeah. I want to do like one more plot point and then we'll call it a day. So even if we go a little over two thirty, that it'll be cool. Right. If you get in trouble, just blame it on me. I'll be fine. I think. Steven's not here. <laughs> He's watching. <laughs> Are you sure? Because I want to go. I want to go to the um, the statue we dropped on the floor. I'm pretty sure. It's here. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're right. Nope. Move forward, press X. Nice. Yes, I will take the blue gemstone. Oh, well, yeah. All right, let's go find our friend. Should I save? I want to save. If you want. Kind of. 
But now you have no more ink ribbons. Oof. You could make a different save if you want. Mm, nah, I'm going to hold on that, I think. Oh, so apparently, like, starting from this point, the game changed a lot from GameCube. Oh, interesting. Yeah, I wouldn't know anything about that. That's interesting. Yeah, I forgot. I, like, I remember, like, when my friend got it for <coughs> GameCube. Shout out to my boy Manny. who just got married. Hmm. Uh, I remember being like, oh, my God, this these graphics are, like, unbelievable. Also, the disc is this big. How is that possible? Okay, so I want to go back up and try the other door. Wait, can you go to the top of the, the middle of hmm? the stairs that you just passed by? The Was there a thing there? At the top of those stairs? Right there? Is that a door? Oh. I kind of thought it was just part of the... I guess... I'm bugging. I'm bugging. No, you're right. You're oh, right. oh, shit. I wasn't. Good job, Paul. And we're outside, I think. I mean, I actually kind of like multiple discs, too. Yeah, yeah same. Yeah, I remember um, I bought The Sims, The Sims 2, Yeah. Um, back in, what was it, 2003, 2004? And it came on freaking four discs. A four-disc download. It was insane. Yeah, I mean, that was, that was like, the case with, like, Final Fantasy VII, Final Fantasy VIII, Metal Gear. I remember Metal Gear the first time we had to, like, pop open the disc tray while it was still on. I was like... Yo, this is magic. Like, we're not supposed to do this. We're breaking the rules. Mm. Oh, shiny thing that we can't get to because it's behind the... It's locked. ...from the other side. Right. I don't think there's anything we can do here right now. Wow, that's wild. Battlefront 2 had four DVDs <laughs> in it. That's wild. I mean, maybe I'm just, like, speaking from nostalgia, but I really like it when you download a game and it's like, disc one has completed. Please in please insert disc two to finish <laughs> the installation process. Cause it, I mean, it's like listening to a record. Like, whenever you have, like, a vinyl record and you put a song on, it's like a mm -hmm. thing. You have to, like, concentrate it on it. Like, totally. Oh, look at the cinematic oh, angle. Oh, yeah, look at that. Look at that. Can I jump on it? No? Oh. <gasps> Ooh. Huh. I wonder what. I wonder what this could be for. Actually, yeah, I do kind of wonder. Use. It won't fit in the can indentation I, I as it? it is. What? Can I break it in half? Combine? Combine? No. Maybe with your, <laughs> combine with your knife. <laughs> can you, like, sand it down? No. Something to break it, I think. Because the arrowhead is definitely for that. But nothing yet, I don't think. All right, back away, back away. All right, so I don't think there's anything more we can do with that right can now. Can you go around that corner? This this way? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, just go in the graveyard. That's totally cool. Yeah, <laughs> yeah let's just casually stor scroll through this graveyard in a mansion filled with undead zombies that all turn out real nice. What's that box right there? Um, which box? That one. Oh, the one that I'm standing in front of? <laughs> that, that <laughs> the one, one right <laughs> in front of you. Is there anything? No. No. Oh. Oh! Look at that. Ammo. Love it. Well, we don't have a shotgun right now, but I assume that'll come in handy for later. I used to love how, like, in the original Tomb Raider 2, like, whatever, I think it was, like, Tomb Raider 2 or something, the first one that, like, you could swim... Mm -hmm. Anytime the game gave gave you like harpoons, mm -hmm. you were like, oh, "All right, yeah, I'm about to face the shark." <laughs> yeah, I never played any of the uh, OG Tomb Raiders, unfortunately. I grew up in a, a Nintendo household, ah. so we didn't have any Playstations. Well, this would have been your first Resident Evil. Yeah. If you had a GameCube and you had any interest in Resident Evil remakes. Yeah, this part I forget what to do, but um, maybe we'll slowly wind it down. Yeah, that seems like a good idea. Because um, as much as I would love to sit here and watch you play Resident Evil all day, we do have to go back to work. Do we? Do we, though? That's true. I mean, we could just I mean, slack we off. we are working. Technically. 
We're working really hard right now to figure out this puzzle. So I am working right. so hard. To get yeah, you are working hard. I'm actually kind of proud of you that you were able to, like, if we look at the beginning of the stream and the end of the stream, you're doing really well. Thank I'm you. really proud Thank of you, you. man. Yeah. Uh, I accomplished something. Today. Um, but yeah, let's, uh, do you want to, so here's, a, do you want to try to solve this puzzle or do you want to call it a day? I think Up we should call it a day. All right, cool. Yeah, maybe we can maybe like continue on day two or something. Yeah, this maybe. This is honestly a lot of fun. Yeah, for real. Yeah. Um. Yeah. Maybe we'll f maybe we'll stream this again sometime because like this is actually kind of a cool experiment. Like I also like the idea of seeing somebody play a thing for the first time. I think it's really fascinating. Uh. So I guess just really quickly out of straight curiosity. Yeah. Do you think it holds up? Um. Like, it, is this exciting and fun to you at all? Oh yeah, absolutely. Yeah? Um. I really love the atmosphere of it. Like. Like creepy haunted mansion always gets me nice. excited. Um, I don't know, like for the actual like mechanics, like the combat and stuff like that. I don't know yeah. if that's just it's just dated a little bit. I feel like sure, like, sure. These days, like like I'm expecting like like pop out button prompts, right? Or interactions with objects. Games hold your hand a lot nowadays. Yeah, and they used to really not do that back in the day. Yeah, and I do kind of appreciate that in a way. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, um, I am super curious to see how the PS1, the PS1 Classic version holds up to a lot of people because, like, uh, yeah, I I want to show you right after the stream. Also, I recommend everybody on the stream or on the watching this on the archive YouTube the original uh, intro to this. It's hilarious. Mm. Uh, it's like the live action intro. It's great. <laughs> but um, yeah, that's a good place to end it for today. Um, maybe we'll stream this again sometime if you if you like it enough. Maybe leave a comment if if you wanted to to see us uh, stream this some more. Yeah, definitely. But. Uh, yeah, thanks for tuning in, everybody. Yeah, thanks, guys. Peace. See you around.